My name's Brendan Reid. I've been with the company for just over four years now. Been in the industry for just over 15 years. I head up the um, sales side of the engineering uh, department. Whereas predominantly on the plumbing and ACR side, we deal with kind of C106 standard uh, copper tube. We also deal with ETP copper tube and we also look at different alloys. So uh, copper nickel, 9010, 7030. And we also have access to um, aluminium brass, which just shows the different diverse package that we can offer to our customers. Let's have a look at some of the products within the engineering department. So this is copper nickel tube, 9010 specifically. So this is used within seawater applications due to its corrosive resistance. So it's 90% copper, 10% nickel. Uh, we also do other copper nickels, which is 70% copper, 30% nickel. These can be manufactured in, in a variation of different lengths depending on the customer's requirements. We can also supply in level one coil. This is an example of our oval tube. So this is used for induction mainly and it's uh, C101 um, alloy. The reason for the oval is because it creates a greater surface area. A main application for this tube would be in furnaces actually. So they will send a current through the tube and it will melt the, the copper. This is an example of one of our large copper tubes. So it's got quite a heavy wall. Um, we do quite a lot of work within this distillery business. So we're looking at say a one inch OD with a 10 gauge wall. This material is being used in heat exchangers um, and we do a lot of business within this market. Not only do we do this size, but we can also do much, much bigger, depending on what the customer's requirements are. So the application for our tube is endless, from automotive to boats, to heat exchangers, to induction. There is endless, endless opportunities for, to use our copper tube. So if you've got any inquiries, get in touch with our sales team.